Hello guys, uh, welcome to my channel. This is Joy. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to operate our latest Wi-Fi Mini Hidden Spy camera, the Mini Hidden Spy type. In this video, I will show you how to connect this camera with the phone and how to operate it. Okay, let's get started. To operate uh, this Wi-Fi Hidden Spy camera, uh, we need a phone. The phone need install the app V380 Pro. You can find this on the Google Play and the App Store. And you can scan the code from the user menu. And one SD card. The at least the C4 SD card is better use the class 10 SD card, high speed type. Uh, first, we check the camera. Here's the camera. The uh, camera here is a TF card slot, and here is the reset. Use the pin to insert it, hold it for three seconds when power on, okay, to reset. And there is no other key. You just plug it to the power and it will start. The power input is 5, just the same as the smartphone. This can be rotate the lens. It can be rotate different. Yes, like this. Okay. Here's the user menu. Uh, you can get the app from scan the code v380 pro here are the steps uh, you can read the user menu and follow those steps to operate the wi-fi hidden camera no this in chinese version. okay now i show you first we connect uh, the camera to the power According to the user menu, uh, this camera first start, we need to wait about 40 seconds, 40 seconds for first start. And after 40 seconds, you need to, re uh, you need to put the reset, uh, reset key. The reason why we need to put a reset because before the camera, uh, before camera counts, uh, counts to customer's hands, the factory need to check the camera's function. So sometimes they may, uh, they may didn't uh, reset all the device. So we need to reset by ourselves. Just uh, just make sure the camera can work normally. Uh, there is no indicator light in this version. So you just uh, calculate the time, and I think I guess now it's around forty seconds. So I use this to press. Okay, three. You press the reset reset pin to the reset hole. You need to make sure you press to the reset. Reset key. Uh, when you res when you insert the correct position, it will have you can you can fail it. Okay. Now let's use our phone to check the Wi-Fi. According to user menu, we need to find the Wi-Fi name MV. Yeah, this one, MV five seven four nine. Yeah, this one. We connect. Now it's already connected, but no internet. At this step, I suggest uh, I suggest we can we can turn off the five G type. You can forget this Wi-Fi, the five G type, because when we connect the camera with phone, 
if you connect to 5G Wi-Fi, it、uh, will influence the connection between Wi、uh, between camera and the 2.4G Wi-Fi. Okay, now let's back to the app. Enter the app. We find、uh, the app is already find this camera nearby, so we can just connect it. Click connect, or we can click here and kind of find the QR code. This one, and you can see at the bottom it. It have discovery discovery the device's ID. You can just click. If if you didn't if you uh your phone didn't find the camera, you can click the Wi-Fi smart camera like this. You first you select the Wi-Fi. You select two point four G Wi-Fi. This is our office. Wi-Fi routers, Wi-Fi. Okay, connecting. Now we need to wait. This connection depend、uh, the speed depends on the Wi-Fi speed. If your Wi-Fi speed is fast enough, connection is good. It will be very fast. This really takes a long time. Okay. Home office. You can select name. You can make a name of the camera. Finish. Nice loading. Ah,、uh, it's not. Okay. You can see it, this one. Ah,、uh, this one is.、Uh, this one is another device. Okay. This one is a new device. Office. It have name. Okay. Just click, set password. Two, three. three. Uh, when you remove this device from the app, you need. Enter this password. So you, re- you need to remember this password. We confirm. Okay, it works. Click here. You can hear the voice. Uh, the voice we 
talk, talk to Camor. You know the the voice we are just suck around. <laughs> okay. Uh, here is the, for the resolution SD and HD. Here is multi screen. Uh, if we connect other device, the, another device is offline. Okay. Uh, this is big item, but uh, due to for this cam uh, for this camera, this one just have microphone but no speaker. So if you speak, uh, there have no no voice because this app can support multi device, not only this camera and other cameras it also can support. When the camera have speaker, you can hear the voice to way audio. Here's snapshot and record. Uh, Re recording. This recording footage will be saved in your phone album, not in SD card. A replay. For the replay, we have two different modes: the cloud service or the micro SD card. Micro SD card, but I didn't put this SD card, so you cannot check. Uh, remember the SD when you insert the SD card. You you need uh, the camera will record automatically, and the video will be ten minutes per video. Ten minutes per video. Okay. Let's check other function. The housekeeper. Uh, when the camera detects the motion, it will save the alarm, uh, send the alarm to the to the app. Here's the setting. The alarm is on. The alarm is on. You can set alarm period, alarm area. Okay. Uh, this is for cloud. This one you can delete, you can share device, and you have setting. General office network. Password device time. Phone well. Alarm setting. Record setting. Uh, when you put SD card, it uh, will have the information of SD card. You can choose uh, turn on the continuous recording. Continuous recording. Uh, when the SD card is full, it the camera the camera will delete the preview video first, then continue record. Just like uncut dash cam, uncut dash cam, yeah. Record audio event recording. Advanced setting. Consider language, English, and others. Okay, uh, this one I already connect. I connect this one. Now I check these two devices. It's offline. Device offline. Okay. Offline. We need to wait. Wait about 40 seconds for this new one to start. And this one we have put SD card inside. Loading, loading. Okay. I am waiting. It's okay now. Hmm. Okay, now this one 
It's online, online. Hey, do you? You're long, online. Check the multi screen. Mm, the network is not is not very good. And check for this camera. We we have put the SD card. We check the micro SD card view. Uh, the red one means the when when people trigger the motion alarm, it will record the video in red in red color. You can hear it record in voice. Okay. And in this camera here, we can check the settings. The record setting, you see? Storage. Continuous recording, even recording, record audio. Uh, for, and for the power sources, it also can f um, power from the power bank. For the power bank, uh, the 8000 mAh capacity, is, the camera can work about 10 hours, about 10 hours. And you can show. If others they have the app, you can share this device to your friends, your families, and others. Okay, uh, that will be all for operation for this camera. Uh, if any of you have question about this camera, you can just let me know. I will give you the detail introduction in the coming video. Okay, thank you all. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.